What's your reaction to know that you're no longer a Yankee and heading to, I guess, Cincinnati? Um, first of all, with regards to that, I, I'm very excited to be joining a club that's, uh, you know, in their position. Um, I have a lot of familiarity with not only the Reds, but the, you know, their division as well, and, and a lot of the opponents they have. I've already checked the schedule, so I'm just excited to go out there and play meaningful baseball down the stretch here. I mean, you know, we, we've experienced it, you know, with this organization. I've experienced it in my, you know, in my, you know, um, career with the St. Louis Cardinals, playing meaningful baseball in September. Uh, that's really important, and, and it, it means a lot because it's a long season. So I'm just excited to join those guys. Um, you know, some young players. I know David Bell. Um, so. Yeah, on that front, I'm very excited. And, um, you know, I just want to say, too, um, I know I've kind of said it, oh, you know, we might not get claims, so I don't really want to say goodbye firmly. But, um, you know, just uh, <laughs> uh, growing up in Manhattan, family lives in Bronxville. Um, I went to, you know, I went to Horace Mann on 242nd Street. Obviously, Yankee Stadium's on 161st Street in the Bronx. Um, you know, I never thought I'd ever play in the big leagues, let alone uh, in the Yankees uniform. And I have no idea what's to come for the future. Um, and I certainly hope it's in Yankees uniform again, uh, if that's an option. But um, we don't know what the future holds. So with that said, I just uh, it just means so much to me to, uh, to be a New York City kid playing in the Bronx uh, for the Yankees. And um, yeah, it's just really special for a lot of reasons. So um, there's just a lot of good moments. And I'm just really excited because regardless of the situation, no one can ever take the fact that I put that uniform on. Um, growing up in that city, which uh, which means a lot to me and a lot of people who support the Yankees for all these years. So I'm just very, very excited and thankful for the opportunity. Um, and man, that was uh, that was that was special. So I appreciate everything with you guys. And and yeah, uh, we'll just see where it takes us. So I just wanted to say that. It's emotional for you, huh? A little bit, yeah. Uh, the game's emotional, I think. You know, we, we pour our entire heart into it every single day, you know? Um, you know, when you wake up as a baseball player, you think about the game. You don't ever think about, oh, where am I going to end up as a team? Where am I going to get traded to? This and that. Um, but, but to be going through the situation, I think, is, is good. Um, it just shows you that at the end of the day, regardless of the uniform, uh, it's all about the ball. It's all about respecting the game and taking care of your business to, to play for as long as you can and to be as good as you can. And, uh, you know, yeah, things happen behind the scenes and whatnot. But at the end of the day, getting a chance to go out there and play uh, at this level is just so special. And any kid that gets a chance to play this game at any level, just, just know how special it is. Um, so yeah, I'm just uh, I'm happy to get to go do it now uh, in the Queen City, and uh, I'm just excited to see how it shakes out for me. I'm I'm excited. I can't be more uh, you know grateful for everything along the way. What's the top memory you take from your time, your short time here? Is it just the fact that you were able to put the uniform on? Um, I mean, yeah, I mean that was special every day. Um, not only the uniform too, but the personnel involved, um, all the people behind the scenes. This guy to my right too, Z, super professional. Um, it's just, it's refreshing to be able to, to be around people of that caliber at all times when I was walking through these doors. Um, and then you step on the field, I mean, the guys uh, from Judgy, you know, all the way to everybody else across the diamond. Uh, you know, Garrett Cole, and I'm, I just have so much admiration for so many guys. So, so to be able to do that in this, in this organization with the history behind it, that was so special. But, you know, individually, just, just being in the postseason as a New Yorker, I mean, I had nothing to lose. Um, I had nothing to lose. And I told myself too, which I told Meredith earlier today, um, September 20th, when I, when I debuted as a Yankee, and the first time I took the field, I think right before I was, uh, you know, the game was about to start on the line, I, I told myself everything from this exact moment on is just a cherry on top uh, because it's all good. Um, so, you know, at, at times the game speeds up, you know, you get frustrated here and there, but, you know, looking back on it, man, it, it, it was a cherry on top, and I, I stuck to that every day. So I'm, I'm happy about that one. Fair to say it's a pretty bittersweet day overall. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. It is what it is. It is what it is. Um, I love St. Louis, um, but I, I got an opportunity to play, um, you know, deep into the playoffs here. That was a that was a blessing that I didn't really know how was that gonna, that was going to shake out for me. Um, so maybe this situation will be something similar to it. But all I know is I, I have you know blind faith, um, not only in this game, but but in what I'm capable of doing it. Um, so I think uh, just keeping that mindset will alleviate a lot of the. Uh, the emotions and whatever might come from that, because at the end of the day, when there's a baseball game being played, I know what I could do on that field um, for the organization I'm trying to help win. So it's all it's all there is to it. You gonna fly to Cincinnati today, then? Tomorrow. Yeah, I'm flying out right now. We got a doubleheader tomorrow. <laughs> I wouldn't want it any other way. <laughs> wouldn't want it any other way. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. Yeah, and like I said too earlier, there were familiar teams um, on there. So. Uh, 
Listen, it never stops. It never stops. So I'm excited. And thank you guys for everything, too. It's been, thank you. Thank it's been fun. You.